Hi everyone, this is the iPad Touch 4th generation and I'm gonna be showing you my 5 top tricks. Uh, the first thing that you need, you need jailbreak. If you don't have jailbreak, I'm gonna have a link on my description uh, taking you to my other video showing you how to jailbreak the iPad Touch 4th generation. The first thing that you have to do is go to Cydia. When you finish loading, you go to search, and then you're gonna click here in the search box, and you're gonna write activator. Then you're gonna select the first one, and you're gonna click install, and you're gonna confirm. Now you have to you have to restart Springboard. You're gonna click on it. Now this is how the activator will look like. Um, you can use the activator to basically with activator you can set a bunch of commands uh, with different buttons on the iPad touch now let's get out now let's go back to Syria this will be my second tweak um, that is called SB settings so I'm gonna back it up I'm gonna wait for this to load gonna clear your previous search you're gonna type S B settings you tap the one that has the red icon and you're gonna click install confirm Now you have to restart Springboard again so it can take effect. Now with SP settings, um, you can hide icons and tweaks that you install on your iPad Touch for generation. Um, and also you get an extra menu if you tap on on the top to the left you get this menu and you can turn on and off the Bluetooth you can control the brightness you can turn off the data uh, you can control the location you can turn it on and off you can control the process uh, you can cancel everything that is open and you can free up memory also, you have control over the Wi-Fi. You can turn it on and off. Um, you can refresh the device. Uh, you can resprint the device. And you can also power on and off the device. And if you click on the power, you will get this menu. You will get reboot, power off, safe mode, lock, and cancel. If you go to more, 
it will take you back to the SB settings icon and here's where you can hide um, applications and other stuff so my third twig is active dog I'm gonna go to Syria in order to get this one uh, we will have to add a source I will show you how to do it So now that it's done loading, you click back. You clear your previous search. And you go to manager. And then you go to sources. And the first thing that you do here is delete the one that says repo666.ultrasnow.com. Uh, we don't need that. This is not an iPhone. So we can delete it. Now you click on edit. You want to click on edit add and then you're going to type repo that m a r c i a n o p h o n e dot com forward slash that's repo dot marciano phone dot com then you're going to click on add source and you're going to wait for it to install. And then you're going to click on return to Cydia. Now we're going to go into the source. Uh, but before we do that, go to changes right here in the middle and click on where it says upgrade and then confirm. Return to Syria. Now go to back to manage. And here we are. And now we're going to look for Active Dock. And you're going to install it. And you're going to confirm. Basically, what this trick does is when you get a notification or email or something on your device, it will, uh, the icon is going to start bouncing. So that's why it's called active dog then you're gonna click on restore springboard now the twig number four it is called android lock xt basically that is um a lock screen that looks like the android one uh, it's gonna be the I'm gonna show you right now. Let's go to Syria. And right here in my Siano phone source, you're gonna go back and you're gonna look for Android Lock. There we go. Android Lock XT. And you're going to install it.
you're gonna click on restart springboard now you got a pop-up that says under lock xt please go to settings under lock xt to set your partner your pattern so you unlock to activate the lock screen you will go to settings you're gonna search for for la um, for Android lock right here and you're gonna enable and then you're gonna click on the first one and you're going to set up your password so mine will be very simple like that then I get out I lock my device and when I unlock it there you go And my last tweak is gonna be a hack for a game um, for the All Fat 8 so you can get unlimited money. But before I do that, I'm gonna hide the activator and the SB settings into utilities. And now, if you go in, you can see that they are both there. But now I'm gonna hide them so no so no one can see them and in order for me to do that I go to SP settings and then I click on the first thing that says show icon for the SP settings I'm gonna turn it off and now the SP settings are going to disappear from that folder and now I want to hide the activator um, icon so I have to scroll down and go to where it says system wide options and click where it says hide icons and now you look for the activator and you turn it off and now you get out so you see that they're still there For um, in order to take effect you have to respring the device so you're gonna swipe this and then you're gonna click on respring So there you go. They're not there anymore. So my last one is Alphat 8 cheats. That's for me to get unlimited money on, on that game. So in order for me to get that tweak, I have to add another source. So we're gonna click on edit. We're gonna click on add. And then we're gonna type repo that byte your apple dot net and then you're gonna click on add source and you're gonna wait for it to install you're gonna get this um, warning saying that this re uh, repository has been reported by the community to be illegally redistributing copyright works but you're gonna click on add anyways and you're gonna install Then you're gonna click on return to Cydia. You're gonna go to changes and upgrade and confirm.
return to Syria. And you're gonna search. And you're gonna type A S P H A L T eight cheats and you're gonna select the one the fourth one that says alpha 8 hack and then you're gonna install it Okay guys, this has been my 5 top tweaks for the iPad Touch 4th generation. I'm gonna be making a part 2 of another top 5 tweaks. Um, the one that I just installed right now was Activator, SB Settings, Active Dock, and Android Lock XT, and Asphalt 8 Cheats. Um, I'm going to leave all the sources in the description. Um, thank you for watching my videos. If, if you like my video, please click the like button. Subscribe to my channels. And thank you for watching. Bye-bye.